What's going on everybody? Going to be doing a packet tracer for 8.3.1.4 on the Cisco 1 curriculum. Alright, uh, we're going to start off this packet tracer by going into the R1 configuration, command line interface. We're going to get in our configuration and before you start you need to do your subnetting. You need to subnet before anything to, just to get these addresses to start. Okay, so starting off on R1, we're going to go into the G0 slash 0 interface. So interface G0 slash 0. All right, IPv6 add. And we're going to add that IPv6 for R1 G0 slash 0 LAN. So it's going to be 2001 DB8 ACAD 00C8. All right, and for the next part, you see how it says 0 slash 64 over here? Well, you're not going to use that 0. You're going to replace it with a 1 slash 64. All right, after you have that done, you need to issue the IPv6 add FE80 semicolon semicolon 1 link dash local. And after you've done that, you're going to issue the no shutdown command. And the interface should come up like so. Okay. Still going to be in the R1 interface. So just exit that interface that you're currently in. Go into interface G0 slash 1. IPv6 add 2001 DB8 ACAD. Uh, C9 semicolon semicolon 1 slash 64 okay now same exact thing we're gonna issue the IPv6 uh, add FE80 1 link dash local alright once you've done that issue the no shutdown command it's gonna bring that link up right over here all right. And now we're going to configure the serial 000 interface. So exit out of that interface. Go into the interface serial Z0, sorry, S000. <sighs> Once you're into that interface, you want to configure the IPv6 address for that interface. And I didn't quite get that IP address, so let me go do the subnetting for that real quick. All right, I'm quite sorry about that. I had to go get the addresses. Now, once we're in serial 000, you want to configure it with the FE80 semicolon semicolon 1 link local address, IPv6 address. So now that we're in the serial 000 interface, we're going to issue the IPv6 add. 2001 db8 acad 00cc you don't have to put the 00 and we're going to do 1 slash 64 once you've done that you need to issue the ipv6 add fe80 1 link dash local and then issue the no shutdown command. Okay, that link state is set to up. And now we're going to configure R2 serial interface. Okay. Well, I'm sorry, we're going to configure R2. So once we are in R2, you want to go ahead and enable, get into your configuration. And we're going to be configuring the zero, G0 slash 0. So go ahead and get into interface G0 slash 0. IPv6 add 2001 DB8 ACAD 00CA 1 slash 64. And now IPv6 add FE. 80 and instead of a 1 this time we're going to put a 2 there and then link local 
no shutdown. All right. Should bring that link up right there. All right, exit out of that interface, and let's go into the G0 slash 1 interface. So interface G0 slash 1. And we're going to issue it the IPv6 address for R2 G0 slash 1 local area network. That's going to be IPv6 2001 DB8 ACAD 00CB1 slash 64. I can't stress enough to put a 1 instead of a 0. I know it says zero, but you have to put the one there in order for it to work. Okay. IPv6 add uh, FE80 to link dash local. Going to issue the no shutdown command after that. Now let's configure the serial 000 interface on R2. So exit the current interface, interface serial 0, 0, 0. Let me pull up that IPv6. Okay, IPv6 add 2001 DB8 ACAD 00CC 2 slash 64. IPv6 add FE. 80 to link dash local and issue the no shutdown command. All right, and that will conclude our packet tracer for today. And after that, your packet tracer should be complete. Oh, one more step I forgot. You need to go into every single PC to the desktop and set the auto config. You need to have every end device set to auto config. And I apologize for the noise in the background. I have a lot of people in our apartment. And now it should be completed 40 out of 40. Thank you very much. This is Dat Boy from Hack Forums. Thank you.